Good morning and welcome to my Saturday. We've got two gigs today. The first one is open air and it's a pub gig, but like an open air pub gig. So we're undercover. There's a bit of marquee covering for some of the audience and we're kind of relying on it not to rain. <laughs> and I was just checking the weather <laughs> and this popped up. <laughs> so I'm not quite sure what's going to happen, but look what we got coming tomorrow. Oh, storm warning for all of Wales and loads of England. My boyfriend has just gone to get coffee number two. So he liked to have two coffees and lots of chatting that's if we get a chance and we're not rushing out somewhere first thing in the morning this is what we like to do on the weekends if we can the second gig is with a slightly different band like it's got some members that were in the the pub gig and some other members that weren't and a different caller it depends who's available you see later on it's a wedding one in the evening so i'll be very minimal about what i'll be able to film and in fact the pub gig i probably it's going to be very difficult to film because it's not like a Kaylee where you can hide behind people when the dance has been explained and film bits and bobs. It's, it's not going to be like that. It's literally on the stage doing a performance all the way through. So I'll get what I can, but we'll see what happens with the filming. <laughs> and tomorrow I've got a day off and I'm staying here another day with my boyfriend. So we'll do something together, which will be lovely. And then on Monday I start my course. I'm so excited for that. Oh look, it's made me coffee. IB is standing looking out of the window at the rain. How's it looking out there? Well, it's <laughs> Was that a burp on my vlog? Well, no, that was something outside. <laughs> Tractor backfired. Really? Okay, yeah. so how's the weather looking anyway? It's uh, a light drizzle. IB's left his practice till the very, very, very last minute. He says he hasn't got time for lunch because he's too busy practicing and then we'll have to go to the gig. So I'm being mum and making him a sandwich and I'm going to go and post it into his mouth now. <laughs> I am using the Oslohovel. He's a Norwegian. I don't think this one was. I went to Norway as a 16 year old and we absolutely loved these cheese slices. And the family that we stayed with bought us one each as a souvenir to take home. And I managed to find one in a shop or something and bought it for IB as well. Because I think they're so good. Though that said, I think he's gonna want a bit more cheese than that in his sandwich. I better do a double layer. There's his ham cheese and salad sandwich. I'll go and deliver it now. Um, there's something very strange going on with the cling film. <laughs> I was gonna wrap the ham up. Oh, I'll figure it out. There's my cheese one. I'm going to eat that now. We're going in about 25 minutes and IB still hasn't had his shower. Well, we've arrived at the pub. I completely lost track of time. I was editing and I suddenly realised, oh my gosh, it's time to leave. So I hurriedly packed everything and we're just here. There's another band on at the moment, but we're on in about 10, 15 minutes, something like that. The weather is looking like it could rain at any second. In fact, I think I felt a spot and we've left our gear not undercover by the stage so hopefully we don't have to do a man dash any minute now. <laughs> do you dogs hello say hello YouTube yes that's right oh there's another one coming hello yes. I'm vlog for ages we're just waiting to go on people are packing down the kit from their previous gig, uh, previous bands, and we're sort of hovering on the side, giving them some space to get out. Oh, it's clearing up a bit now, be on any second. I suspect it'll be all go in a minute, so I dare say next time I speak to you, it'll be after we've finished the gig. Oh, it's later, we've done the gig, we're going to go and watch a couple of numbers of our friend's band which looking forward to now look this is my emergency plan power supply trying to charge it up in time for the next gig this evening hello did you enjoy the music did you what's that you want something by Bach? well you never know the next band might do it oh you two are very very handsome where did you come from you weren't there earlier no god there's loads of you 
Ooh, 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 calm down. Oh, I didn't know we had goats in the audience. They're just getting ready to go on. from that gig now luckily we weren't doing the PA for that one somebody else was because it was a multi-band event so we we're able to get away well I say relatively quickly but we realized our friend's band was on which you just saw so yeah we obviously didn't want to rush straight off so we caught a couple of numbers by him and we rather envisage we'd have a bit more time than we have now <laughs> between getting in and leaving but we have 20 minutes and we have to go on to the next gig we're all a bit hungry but we haven't got time to cook or anything so I'm just gonna eat crisps and make a sandwich or something like that I think and drink a cup of tea very quickly. Got the kettle on. Oh, I'll have an apple. I could eat it in the car actually, couldn't I? Oh, now can I stir left handed? I don't know. That's a challenge. There's only three of us here. We've left Dan at the pub. Sam was doing the gig with us just now, and he's not doing the gig with us tonight. We got a bassist instead. It's a bit complicated, but three of us are the same people. We're very interchangeable, you know. We're on our way to the gig and we haven't had any food, so we're probably gonna grab a sandwich or something from a carriage on the way. Oh, here we are, we got a prawn sandwich, 450, blinking it. That's a bit expensive, isn't it? I fancy that. Smoked oh. salmon and cream cheese. Oh, are you treating me? Oh, that's nice of you. The posh M&S petrol station. <laughs> They look nice, don't they? Oh, wow. We are getting fed at tonight's gig, though, so it's just to tide us over for now, really. We'll eat this in the van now. Oh, oops. <laughs> school actually a lovely big dance floor look at that fancy lighting rig up there very nice we're all set up look i'm backstage look at this look <laughs> this is behind the stage basically we're on here i can't really film tonight it's somebody's wedding party we'll be starting in about 20 minutes something like that they wanted to start a bit earlier but they're still waiting for people to arrive people are drifting in gradually now and they're serving up food as well it's going to be a cake break in between the two sets, apparently. It's just coming up.
been up to about half 11 I think we've just finished and we were playing the last set and there was this almighty bang and then a sudden load of really screechy feedback and we were like <gasps> what's that? I like, managed to keep playing just about and I like, dropped out for a second or two and I was like oh what's that? The bass exploded, the double bass, a bit broke on the bottom of the double bass, a metal thing snapped and the bridge fell off, the bridge is like the big wooden bit that holds the strings up, it just it fell off and all the strings were just like flapping about on it. Anyway, it'll be fine. He just needs to fix the bottom bit that broke or, you know, get a replacement with it. But oh my goodness, that's never ever happened <laughs> before in all the years of doing this. The double bass just randomly exploding in the last number. Anyway, I need to put away gear now. I'll speak to you later. It's a quarter to one in the morning. We've been back a little while. We've had a cup of tea and a sit down and now we are going to bed. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.